I got lucky this time. And I made this. About a year ago, I tried to decompile Colony Dino Hunter. I noticed that a lot of data was missing, and then I realized that it was being downloaded from the server. After doubting myself a lot, eventually I came to the conclusion that I needed to mod the latest version to get the configs. And with the help of Gamers Unite, that's exactly what I did. And once that was done, it only took me a few weeks to fix everything. So even with the hardest part out of the way, it was still far and away the most difficult decomp and recomp yet. But finally, I finished it. So why was I so dedicated to doing this? Well, Dino Hunter is my favorite Call of Duty game, and the only way to play it now is through the terribly balanced, latest, free iApp garbage version. Anyways, enough about that. Let's get into the normal stuff. Dino Hunter is pretty much just a better version of Call of Duty Zombies 2. In pretty much every way, this game and Double Shot are probably the only games I would actually grind while playing offline. And I am not a big grinding person, so that's saying a lot. Oh, and I guess Zombies too, because I grinded that for a while while testing. I was going to remind everybody to check their devices for squad data, but something happened, and well, I don't need it anymore. All the PC controls are linked in the description, alongside the source code and the builds for Android and PC. And of course, no iOS. But maybe not ever. Because if Steve can get his Mac working, then we can get some builds out for iOS. But just remember, you can't exactly install apps on iOS without either jailbreaking or having a PC. So yeah, maybe now you'll understand why I never bothered. And about modding the game, good luck, have fun, I'm sure you will love the not at all confusing code. Also in the description is a link to the Call of Many server, co-owned by me and the original owner Steve. It contains all recomps of Call of Many and also other extra stuff like iOS archives being made by WTP. It also contains leaks and promo images being made by Negahorn, and also something else I'm working on, which I haven't posted on this channel yet, but let's just say it will definitely change the Call of Many scene. For years to come. I hope you'll enjoy Dino Hunter because it took me almost a year to get to this point and I really hope that was worth it. And I will see you all in the next decompilation.